All right, fighthype.com here with my man Virgil Hunter. Virgil, obviously, the press conference is over. Um, we got the weigh-in tomorrow. What exactly do you do between now and then the weigh-in and, and then the fight? I mean, are you guys just kind of winding down right now? Exactly. It's wind-down time and, and uh, you know, reflection time and going over things in your mind and making sure you covered all the bases and didn't leave no stone unturned. So you don't have to second guess yourself. So it's, you know, but it's a pace that's good for you. You can mm -hmm. take your time now. All the demands are out of the way and uh, it's time to recharge, mm -hmm. you know, refocus. So that's that's the mode I'm in now. Is it is it difficult for you to do just like normal things, like get sleep and stuff like that? Is, is that hard? No, it fight? depends. Now, to last night I didn't sleep much because it was a lot going on. And, you know, when you're in a strange bed, hey, I yeah. got a great bed at home, you know, a <laughs> Tempur-Pedic. So, you know, when you sleep on a bed, excuse me, yeah, fast up time. <laughs> you know, you know, sleep on a, a different bed like the one I was sleeping on. No offense, I don't know what kind of mattress it is, but it, yeah. you know, it makes it uncomfortable for you. you. Toss and turn. I'm a tall, big man, 220, mm -hmm. 230, so... You know, it does affect you. Does, does, does just thinking about the fight, processing it, and is that like a mental strain on you? No, I don't think about the fight at all at this point. Mm. You know, um, I did all of that in camp. Mm. Now it's time to let go and think about what I need to do during the fight. Be prepared to make a suggestion, make an adjustment. Uh, and be prepared to watch Kovalev in the fight. Mm. I know that pretty much all the talking is done now um, since we're you know 48 hours from the fight. But 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 is the fight actually still going on now? Do you, do you guys still you know have a mental battle? I mean, I, and I only asked just because I know we were downstairs and and, and Kovalev just walked by us, mm -hmm. um, which was kind of odd to see. He looked like he was just hanging out in the hotel. <laughs> yeah. Um, but, he was um, on his way to running somewhere, huh? Yeah, actually it did. It did look like that. Um, but, um, but yeah, is, Ooh, is, is, is the battle... Yeah, I know you're mm -hmm. tired. That's a sign, fans. we got to keep this short. That's right. But, <laughs> but, but is the battle still going on right now, or, or, or are you just kind of you know zoned in and locked in to what you guys do as opposed to locked worrying about in, them? but you don't want to compress the situation. You know, you want to give it a free flowing movement, just a running stream of thoughts and troubleshooting and and uh, scenarios that mm -hmm. you might encounter and how you'll handle that situation. So the weigh-ins tomorrow, is there anything that you look for going into the way like like when you actually do hit the way in, are you gonna be analyzing Kovalev, looking at his body, check you know, reading his his language that he's presenting to you? Well, one of the tell signs if he had to crash a lot of weight off is in the eyes. Mm. It's also the color and shine of the skin. Mm. And also the uh being he being he's uh European, you know, uh where they were most Europeans uh will blush here. Mm. You know, if he's in good shape and he has a shine on him, he'll have a, sh a blush here. Mm. Um, and also look for other things, scar tissue around the eyes, mm. uh, you know, cuts and scars that he's encountered in ring combat. And, uh, mm. you know, let him remember where they are. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I did, I did, just one last question. I did, I did want to know your thought. I don't know if you saw, but during the face-off, um, it, it looked like Kovalev reached his hand out trying to shake Dre's hand and, and Dre didn't have anything to do with it. He, I think he kind of gave him a little dab or something like wow, that. Wow, I didn't see that. Oh, yeah. No, really? yeah. Yeah, you got to watch the weigh-in. I mean, yeah. not the weigh-in, but the face-off from the press oh, conference. Oh, today. Yeah, today. To today. Yeah, they they were, you know, face-to-face -face mm -hmm. and, and uh, Kovalev reached his hand down and, you know, Dre was, you know, he had a stern look on his mm -hmm. face and just kind of dabbed him and yeah. didn't shake his hand. Is that is that part of the mind game still, or, or is that just something? Well, you know, it could have been a display for the press for the, you know, eight or eight or nine weeks ago when that handshaking thing came up. Mm. You never know, you know. Mm -hmm. uh, I think that Serbia is prompted to do a lot of things, you know, that mm -hmm. maybe he doesn't think about on his own, but I didn't see it, but uh, now that I'm hearing it went the way it did, I'm not surprised for the Dre's response. Does is that does that please you that that was his response? Like is is that kind of what you were hoping to see from him? Well, I mean, you you do have to have a measure of being a gentleman, mm -hmm. 
and measure of being dignified. You know, um, I might not initiate the handshake, but if you mm -hmm. initiate it, you know, I'll accommodate you. So mm -hmm. if he accommodated him, that's a good thing. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Well, Verge, that's that's all I've got now. I, I appreciate you letting me come up. I don't know what time is it now. It's like ten or yeah, something like that. Eleven o'clock. Old man to go to sleep. Old man, I'm one yeah. of them. I'm one of them, man. I mean, I can't go to sleep. I got to get this yeah, video up. But right. uh, I definitely appreciate you letting me come in. I don't know if the Anytime, fans. This man. is a beautiful bye, bye. suite that um, you are staying in. I definitely appreciate you letting me come up and and hang out just a little bit. A couple hey, hours before. Anytime, you know, you're my man. So yeah, that's what's up. Every fight you've been there. Hopefully, you know, we can continue to ride. Always. Always, for sure. All right. All right. Appreciate you, Verge. Right,